stop here in Germany, of course, we had to stop by the famous Berlin. And not only are we staying in Berlin, we're actually staying on a boat in Berlin, which is so cool. city of Berlin, Germany, hoping that this rain holds off. It, uh, so far we've been good, but the clouds are pretty dark. To start our day here in Berlin, we took the 300 bus, which picked us up right near where we're staying, and we got off at the Alexanderplatz SNU stop, so that's where there's a whole bunch of connections, the S-Bahn, the U-Bahn, and we are walking over to the park portion of it, which has some cool things to check out. Oh, yes. So we just left Alexander Platz and we are headed towards the Berlin Dom, Berlin Cathedral. I can see it in the distance. There's a really cool Neptune fountain here at the Alexander Platz, which is totally worth checking out. This 
place behind me is something called the Humboldt Forum. There is an area called the Sculpture Hall where you can see the original sculptures, but unfortunately it's closed on Tuesdays. So we are just stopping for a water break. Also put some more sunscreen on because it is really hot today. And a lot of this is in the sun, like the dome behind me. I don't know if you can see it there. Mostly in the sun. There are some trees that provide some shade, but it's pretty hot. I'm here at the Deutsch History Museum. We decided to stop and do this one, first of all, because there's air conditioning and it's so hot outside. But also the tickets are only eight euro, which isn't that bad, and they have three special exhibits we can check out today. So we did have to put our bag in the locker. It costs one euro, but you'll get it back when you put the key back in. That is it for the uh, German History Museum. It was interesting. The main exhibit is actually not open right now, so it's only the special exhibits. So there was a Karl Marx exhibit, a Richard Wagner exhibit, and just one about history in general with a bunch of like passports and Nazi propaganda and that sort of stuff. But yeah, it was really fun. And for eight euros, I don't think it was too bad. Plus it was air conditioned, which is really all we can ask for today. <laughs> Um, the main exhibit is going to be open in 2025. 20? Wow. 2025? Jesus, that's a long time. So we made it here to Brandenburg Gate, which is right behind me. This is by far the most touristy area I have been in Berlin yet. There's souvenir shops, there's people trying to sell you things, but it's really cool. There it is, there's the gates. We found a Reve on the way to the Brandenburg Gate, so we got some food that we can eat. And there's this really nice park just across from where the gate is, so we're just sitting there, enjoying the view and eating our food. Got a salad and two on a giri. I got a little mini pizza and a pretzel bun, and everything came to 10 euros together, so that's pretty decent. Because the restaurants in this area are quite touristy, and we noticed the prices were a little inflated. Um, so we're going to eat closer to where our, our hotel is. Yeah. Alright, and that is everything that I had pinned that I wanted to do. So now we're just going to probably take the 100 bus and just go around. And if there's anything cool, we can just get off the bus and check it out because it's free with our 9 euro pass. <laughs> I got more speed that one time. <laughs> Wall Gallery. So this is part of the Berlin Wall that has been uh, painted over with different 
murals by different artists and is now a gallery that you can walk down. It is directly across from the Ustbahnhof, so not the main Hatzbahnhof, but the what, no, East, East Hatzbahnhof, East. All done here in Berlin. We are headed on to the Czech Republic now. We found this adorable little seating area and now we're just waiting until our bus is loading which should be less than an hour now. Berlin was really cool. So we walked around 14 kilometers every day. We were here for two days. So everything that I really wanted to see but there was a lot of stuff that I had pinned that if we had time we would get to. And we just did not have time. Berlin is so huge and there's so much to see here, so much to do. Chris. <laughs> Berlin is great, but we are on to the next location, so I will see you there.